Welcome student nurses! For today's video, we are going to perform intramuscular injection. So let's start! Number 1. Check accuracy and completeness of each medication administration record with prescriber's medication order. Check patient's name and medication name, dosage, and route, and time for administration. Two, check date of expiration for medication. Expiration date March Three, perform hand hygiene. A septically prepared correct medication dose from ampule or vial. Check label of medication with mar. Two times while preparing medication. Step number four, close room curtain or door. Introduce self and identify patient using two identifiers, name and birth date, or name and account number. According to facility policy, Good morning, Mom. I'm Marcia Mendoza, your student nurse for today. May I know your name and birth date, Mom? My name is Tika Mendoza, and I will be born on October 15, 2001. Compare name of medication and label with MAR one more time at patient's bedside. Explain steps of procedure and tell patient that injection will cause a slight burning or stain. So, ma'am, for today, I will administer medication intramuscularly and it will cause discomfort, but it is tolerable. Is that okay, Yes, sir. Apply clean gloves. Note, if the patient has lactate allergy, use lactate free gloves. Select appropriate injection site. Inspect skin surface over sites for bruises, inflammation, or edema. Mom, which arm do you prefer to the injection? Right arm. Next, help patient to comfortable position. Next, clean site with an antiseptic swab. Apply swab at the center of the site and rotate outward in circular direction for approximately 5 cm.
cold swab or gauze between third and fourth fingers of non-dominant hand. Now, remove needle cup or sheet from needle by pulling it straight off. Hold syringe between thumb and forefinger of dominant hand. Hold a dart, palm down. With the dominant hand, inject needle quickly at 90 degree angle into muscle. Insert needle into the muscle using a smooth, steady motion. After needle persistent, grasp lower end of syringe barrel with non-dominant hand to stabilize syringe. Continue to hold skin tightly with non-dominant hand. Move dominant hand to end of plunger. Do not move syringe. Pull back on plunger 5 to 10 seconds. If no blood appears, inject medicine slowly at a rate of 1 ml per 10 seconds. With the raw needle while applying alcohol swab or gauze gently oversight. Hi, Mom. Apply gentle pressure. Do not massage side. Apply bandage if needed. Help patient to comfortable position. Discard and capped needle or needle enclosed in safety shield and attach syringe into puncture-proof and leak-proof receptacle. Remove gloves and perform hand hygiene. Stay with patient and observe for allergic reactions. Observe patient's response to medication at times that correlate with onset peak and duration of medication. Inspect site noting any bruising or induration. Document bruising or induration if there are any. Chart medication dose, route, site, time, and date given on medication administration record immediately after giving medication. Thank you.